All right, welcome everyone to the third ever marble race. We have quite the crew today. We have 15 different individuals, as you can see, listed over on the side. We have Delta, Josh, Porcupine, Zane, Galaxy, Donnie, Fantic, Thick, Boat, Heye, Jacob, Drew, yeah. Orange Collector, Imon, and Zeus. All right, folks, let's get ready. The clock is ticking down. Three, two, one, let's go. All right, we are off to a good lead. It is Delta out in front? Oh boy, how long is he gonna hold this lead? Oh, it did not last that long. We already got someone else taking that. It is Jacob now out in front. And so far, so good. A pretty commanding lead, I shall say. That's pretty good. Followed by Imon and Galaxy. And then just behind him, we have Heye in fourth place. Oh, and it keeps switching back and forth. We got Imon, we got Jacob. It is currently now Jacob battling it out for first place. Keep swapping positions, first and second. Oh, it looks like Galaxy took second. Jacob moved back to third. And where? Jacob's now in first again. All right, let's continue this on. Let's go. We got Jacob still there, hanging on first. Hey, a second. Galaxy third. So far, so good. <laughs> we have Boat and Porcupine down in 15th and 14th place there. Drew is not looking too good. <laughs> Usually the lucky number 13, but when we're in the marble races, we do not want to be there, folks. I am very, very sorry to see this happen to such a nice man here. Oh, boy. Jacob's still holding on very, very strong to the lead, not wanting to give it up. We are two minutes into this race. I am really hoping for an upset here. Fatality. What is going to happen? It looks like Delta may have fallen off the course. His line has gotten scratched out. Poor old Delta. Maybe you'll get the next one. There's always time for next Fatality. one. Ooh, no. Zeus was in second place, and he got knocked out as well. It's too bad we couldn't have an individual camera for everybody here, but yeah, <laughs> this course is not forgiving. There's some open spots, and if you have too much speed, you are just going to fall right out. All right, that leaves us with 13 contenders still left in the race. Hopefully we don't have too many more casualties. So not much action going on so far. It is seemingly being Jacob in first place the whole time so far. Still followed by Galaxy and Imon. Uh, we have Zane now in 4th place though, Hey has dropped down to 5th, Orange Collector is holding on to 6th place, and then everything after that we're not too worried about, they're pretty far back there for now, so we'll see what happens. Oh no, Fatality. we have our third casualty, Galaxy is now gone, Galaxy has fallen out, Fatality. everybody's just dropping like flies. We are down to only 9 more racers in here. We have Orange Collector coming up hot. He was in third place, now he's up to second. Can he overtake Jacob, the reigning leader of this whole entire race so far? <laughs> Four and a half minutes. There goes Orange Collector taking first place. That was I'm legitimate. I'm on third. Jacob may fall down even further. We'll see. Fatality. And let's take a look. Oh, I don't remember if we lost Zane or not, but we, <laughs> we're down five people in the race. I apologize, Zane, and everybody else that is gone. Maybe your marbles should have stayed in control. <laughs> All right, we are still in lap one. We are probably getting close to the end of the first lap. Orange Collector still doing pretty good, riding the rails here. Um, taking first place pretty dang well. Not sure, oh, he had Drew coming up from behind now. Coming in hot, we can't see first place from Drew's perspective. But Orange Collector and <laughs> right in the ceiling or some type of deal here. Alright, let's go, Drew. Can you take on Orange Collector and pass him up? Let's see what happens. Ooh, Bruh. not too good. Keep hitting those corners quite the wrong angle and keep stopping Orange Collector. Slowing him down very, very much. Ooh, Bruh. he's been sent backwards there. Now we can finally see Orange Collector from Drew's perspective. He is getting very, very close. Nice. I would not doubt we see an overtaking here very, very shortly. 
Oh, and Heye coming out of nowhere, taking first place. Easy! Holy crap! Orange Collector just got left in the dust. Oh, man. <laughs> no one even seen where Heye came from. It was just instantly up in front. We are going into lap two, folks. This could be anybody's game, to be honest, at this point. We have the top three, Heye, Orange Collector, and Drew battling it out for first place. Orange Collector, I don't know what you're doing, but you're just bouncing around, just losing all your speed. Oh boy, this is not looking good. Oh, hey, he took the lead for a second there, but hit a bump in the wall or something and got flung backwards. Orange Collector coming back and taking his rightful place into first. And hopefully he can hold on to that lead for a little bit longer than five seconds this time, but we shall see. And it just looks like Drew just took over into second place. Not sure what's going on with that battle back there. Oh, he's getting very close to getting back into first. Oh boy, it's neck and neck. Bumping into the back of Orange Collector's ball. Can he get it? Can he pass him? We shall see, folks. Bruh. And he had it for a second. And then he hit another bump in the wall. I don't know what's up with these walls, man. But everybody, you hit him too fast into the corner. You're just going to go flying back. And you're going to end up regretting it. You'd rather take those corners slower and maintain that speed rather than get the chance to knock backwards. And it also looks like we did lose another competitor. I don't know how long ago that was, but I am sorry. We have lost Josh as well. You are the sixth competitor to have lost your ball into the outer space of Marble World. We are now reaching the 10 minute mark almost and hey! rides the wall, passes Orange Collector, and takes the oh lead. I cannot believe this, folks. This is quite insane. I mean, out of all the passing moves that could have just happened, that was unbelievable to ride the wall just to pass Orange Collector just like that. And we are getting pretty close to the end here. I am willing to bet it's just going to be a toss-up between Orange Collector and Heye. But I am really, really hoping Drew gets in there to make it an even closer and more entertaining race. Alright, we're coming into the 11 minute mark. We still have Haley in first place. Orange Collector was right there, but hit something in the wall. I don't know why you guys are so good at that, but if you guys find any crack there in the wall just to throw you back. Oh man. Oh, and Drew has fallen back a little bit, but Imon is coming up in the third place. Could we see Bruh. a weird surprise coming up here in a second? Fatality. I don't know what that ramp was, but it looks like Donnie was stuck on there and couldn't Fatality. move anymore, so I'm pretty sure he's out of the race as well. Along with both, they haven't moved places, they haven't passed any of the people that have fallen out. Orange Collector is now gone, as well as Jacob. <laughs> oh, we got Drew right back up into the front with Heye here. What is going on? We're reaching now 12 minutes. It is very, very close, but somehow Heye has managed to hold on to the lead. Bruh. Oh no. He just bumped into the wall. Drew's coming back up. Oh, he's, he's stuck behind Donnie here. All right, I think Drew's quite a bit of ways back. A little bit more than I was thinking, but we shall see what happens. I still can't believe it though, folks. We lost two, four, six, Eight, nine, Fatality. we're down to six racers left. Okay, we still have Heye in first place. Drew's holding on to second, trying to scooch past. He's got past Donnie there, but I don't know, Heye's way, way up there. And then somehow, Imon is in third place. We will see what happens. We are getting very, Bruh. very close to the end. Oh no, Drew has just slowed down so much. I, I don't think this is going to happen for Drew. I am sorry, but... With how slow you just got to that speed, you know, right there, it's not going to happen. Ooh, hold on a minute. Oh, that was so close if there wasn't that boost pad there. Hey, hey might have been having something bad happen as well, but managed to get back his speed pretty quickly there. Reaching 14 and a half minutes here. I believe this finish line is coming up very, very shortly, and by that I mean probably in the next... 30 to 60 seconds we're going to be seeing the end of the race and who will end up being the winner all right hey he's rounding the last couple of corners going up the last couple of hills and can drew make a comeback somehow can <laughs> hey, hey hold on i don't know folks maybe if he gets unlucky hits a wall or something i don't know 
Oh boy. I think I see the end. It's coming very, very soon. Drew, you are too far back, my friend. But there it is. Hey, hey. Congratulations on winning the third ever marble race. And GG. We'll see you guys in the next one. Blaze out. <laughs>